Hey guys, we are here on the surface of Terrace, and time to talk with this Commander Fett. There he is. Oh, a cyborg. So cool you got, Vod. What brings me the honor of having Mandalore's chosen in my camp? I'm hunting Jikon Kadera. You know anything that can help me find him? The traitor? No, no sightings. But then, we don't pay attention to ghosts. Jenkins a lingering shame, best forgotten. You believe he's still alive? It's a bit of a was it Australian accent. Then again, I think Django did too. Actually, I'm not sure where the actor who played it was from. That's what I've been led to believe. If the traitor's alive, it would make some sense. His son was with us until recently. Disappeared. Jikon's kid have a name? Thorian. He came to Taurus along with the rest of my men. Showed a lot of promise in spite of his heritage. It was a shame to lose him so soon. What happened with Torian's disappearance? The boy went missing in action while scouting a nearby Republic colony. Torian was assumed killed or captured by the enemy, but I can't discount the possibility that the traitor was involved. You never get extra options in SWTOR to like, ask questions like you do in Mass Effect. It's always just one, two, or three. You have to advance the, the discussion either way. It's interesting. You believe I'll find something at this Republic colony? Well, a search of the area couldn't hurt. If nothing else, wiping out the colony could earn you a tidy sum. The Imperials want a slaughter, and they're offering credits for Teresian bodies. You can flirt with them. Your assistance is appreciated, Commander. This is the location of the Second Colonial Protectorate. You can claim any bounties next time you come through camp. Reports on the Cathar, sir. I guess that's laying a plot line for later. Alright. So, uh, what is this? Well, these are both class storylines. So, what's this? Huh. Well, they both give lots of XP, so I guess we'll do both of them. But, um,. I guess they're both over there. All right, well, I'll get to the locations for one of these, and I will uh, see you then. Well, we're here, and I guess it's like uh, that guy said. The uh, Both of these quests are in the same instance, which is nice. So, yeah, we'll be killing the Republic colonist as we go. And we'll complete both quests that way, which means extra XP. That is fine with me. I don't know why I care about XP though. Force of habit, I guess. And it's, I mean, it's, it'll be good to have this character as high level as I can get by the end of this thing. But really, I'm doing this for the story because I want to show you guys the story, and I want to get it done for that cool uh, title-ish thing they're coming out with. Where are? Did the call? I did deal with them, didn't I? I guess there's more around here. Stun him before he stuns me. <laughs> Alright, there's the commandos. That was the bonus though, wasn't it? Commander, please don't kill me. Yeah, it says deal with their public colonists. Um, but how? Destroy public droids. I also don't see more public droids. Oh, there's the colonists, I guess. Please don't kill us. We aren't armed. Yeah, they're innocent. Uh, unfortunately, that's not my. I'm looking for someone you may have taken captive. Business. A Mandalorian named Torian. I don't. Anyone know what she's talking about? They don't have what you want. They've been hiding in here since the Imperial transports hit the ground. Let them go, and I'll tell you what you want to know. Yeah, I want to. I want my cake, and I want to eat it too. You're gonna tell me anyway. If I don't like what I hear, they all die. You really don't want to hold out on my friend here. We haven't made contact with any Mandalorian troops, but we've been dealing with sniper attacks the last few weeks. I'm certain the sniper's been taking shelter at an old excavation site nearby, but everyone I've sent to investigate 
is turned up dead. There. You know everything I do. Let the civilians go. God, this game makes you feel like such an asshole sometimes. All right. Helpful, but not enough to overlook what the Empire's paying. Why'd you have to burn them, too? You could have just made it easy and shot them. Poor guy. All in a day's work. I feel like a psychopath now, but I guess at least she's doing it for money and not out of a sick sense of pleasure. That would be psychopathic. All right, I don't know where all these other droids are the bonus quest is talking about, but that's the only other quest here, right? Return and search for Torian. Yep. All right, well, I will start searching then, and I'll be back when I have something to report. And we're back. I think we might have found where one of the Kaderas is hiding. Let's see if that's the case. Yep, there's Torian, the sun. I don't like that. Yeah, yep, definitely don't like this. <laughs> Thought you'd be harder to get the drop on. We can flirt with him. Let's try that. I was just eager to see you again after Drummond Koss. You what? Oh, it's him. I know you. Hmm. Time to tell me what you're doing out here. Ow. I deserve that. You must like him. If I tried that, I'd be wearing my face on the back wall. Not here for me. Who then? I'm hunting Jikom Kadera. Thought I'd lead you to him? I'm looking to, but not for a reunion. To reclaim my clan's honor. You found any sign of Jikom? Someone's erected dew collectors, beast traps, around an old transport station. Have to be the traitors. I'll judge for myself. I've only found one entrance into the station. It's thick with rat ghouls. Risky. Got a way to throw off rat ghouls, but I'll need help. Materials. What sort of materials am I looking for? Fresh rat ghoul bodily fluids. Both blood and waste. And a decomposing rat ghoul. At least a week old. Check these waypoints. We'll rendezvous at the transport station. Great. Collect rat ghoul filth. That sounds like a fun quest. All right. I always said I wanted to collect Rackwell filth just like Luke Skywalker. Um, where's the command center? Is it that one? Yeah, it's that. One. Wait. Yeah. Let me make sure I quick travel to the right place. Not that it really matters, because there's no cooldown on quick travel. Yay! I remember when it used to be like half an hour, and then you could like lower it to ten minutes, and now you can lower it all the way down to zero. So much nicer this way. I got a breakfast soon, it's getting early. I'm on a, a weird sleep schedule right now, don't ask. Um, all right, let's tell Commander Fett the good news about the colonists. If you can call it good news. I feel like we should have given our plate Shadow Devourer a name, but I'm too tired to come up with a good name. Easy play shadow devour. Um, coming, I'm coming. I'll think of something. Welcome back. Recon says you've been wreaking havoc on the Republic forces. Now settlers will be clawing over each other for a shuttle off this sewer of a planet. Your bounty. Good stack of credits by the look of it. Somehow I doubt that. Let me know if you or the Empire need anything else cleaned up. And let you hog all the glory? I don't think so. Good hunting. Yeah, 3600 credits. Reminds me of um, the guy at uh, Tatooine Kotor. Good hunting out there. That was always his line. And ooh, what is this? A passive ability. I will take it. Alright. Good stuff there. Um, we'll be heading over here next, so I will see you guys when we get there. We have returned, and it's time for a bit more questing. Here is a Rackwell carcass we can grab. Now we have to collect 
collect uh, whatever this is over here. I guess we'll kill these guys and see what they drop. Not a fan of these types of quests. Oh, that was a bad mortar volley. I think I can group them up a bit and then just fire them to death. Alright, what we get? Three Rackle Fluids? Alright. Let's attack these guys next. I don't know why I hold the line there. It's usually my 4 speed button, so I'm used to hitting it to charge into battle, but don't get that here. Power attacks are fun, but still love my consulars the best. And Inquisitors. Alright, so just one more. Oh, that sucks. Maybe the big guy has whatever the other thing is I need, the fluids, or do I have to get that over here? Raku filth. Huh. Not sure where we're gonna find that. Oh, I probably should have done that. Well, I guess I can because the cooldown resets anyway. Let's go up again. Hopefully, we get a new companion soon. His gear's gonna be a little obsolete. Oh, why am I not healing? I hit the button. There we go. Uh, what's my gear? 33, I think, is. Yeah. So we're still, that's still alright. I'm gonna try to wait as long as I can. And when I lose a battle, I'll know I've waited too long. Take another stim. Oh, we're running out of XP time, though. Actually, the filth is down there, and the fluids are just around. Is that the filth, maybe? Uh, I think it is. Yay, Rackwell filth. Never thought I would say that. Alright. Let's kill these guys, maybe they'll drop some stuff. Why does this remind me of Planet of the Apes for some reason? How is it getting so uh Heads up too, I have now been awake for quite a while and I'm getting a little tired. Yay, 7 of 10. So if I'm not quite as coherent as I was, apologies in advance. But um, yeah, I really want to finish this, hopefully today, sometime. We still have a ways to go yet, so I don't know if that's going to happen. Oh, we're going to aggro the big guy, aren't we? Yeah, they're tied. Hope they wouldn't be. Hey, got a Rackle Hunter thing here. Sometimes I still hit four just to mix things up. I know it's not worth using. I don't know if it's ever worth using. Can I take off my bar? Quite possibly. If we get another ability that's better than it, I probably will, because I don't see what the point... Well, I guess the range is the thing, but that, I mean, 50 meters, it's not bad. Alright. These guys should be able to, uh... How many more do I need to? I'm gonna shoot them so they kind of gather up to me. I'm gonna mortar volley them. Oh, they're going to him instead, they kind of backfired. Alright, there we go. More than enough. And it doesn't look like we have too much longer to go. I do already have some crafting skills in this character. I have archaeology maxed and decent on armor mech, but um, since she only had two companions, I didn't really bother with it that much. I probably got most of that through conquesting. I wish it would tell you the total amount of conquest points you've earned on a character over your career. That would be a really cool stat. Like they keep track of like Warzone kills and Valor and all. I would love to see that. But alas. Am I going in here? Yeah, over there. Because there are a lot of times, like this week, where we go really hard on Conquest, and I'm always afraid that another guild is going to dump a bunch of crafting mats or a bunch of war supplies in the last couple minutes and catch up to us. So I always try to make sure we have a decent lead. As you can see, we now do. Um, and have others waiting in the wings in case we need to drop them. But then we end up waiting, wasting like more than 400,000 points worth of mats. But you just don't know that at the time, so... Part of winning in Conquest, unfortunately, is demoralizing your opponents. So they stop trying. But I almost wish I could just like whisper them and be like, Hey guys, we have a lot of mats. We're not going to lose this. You know, don't waste your time. But I, that would just be like... Arrogant and bragging. Looks like a train station or something. Is it too much to hope we can catch a ride? Probably. Apparently, this area was actually the Promised Land in uh, from Kotor One. I read that somewhere on the wiki, maybe. 
And there's like a journal or something or some clues somewhere. Oh, I bet he didn't see us. But he did. Okay, should I be using? I wonder if I should be using Missile Blast. Not Missile Blast. Rail Shot first. And then using, uh, you know, uh, uh, what's it called? Sock Strike, Rocket Punch to reset it. And then doing it again. I almost like a uh, flame sweep better because it, it doesn't knock them back, so they stay in the radius. And you aggro them, so they'll come right to you, which keeps them in the radius. You know what? To be honest, for tanks, I think flame sweep is actually better on a per second basis than mortar volley and death from above. But um, somebody told me that at least, so I don't know if it's actually true, but I would assume so. Which kind of sucks. I like the idea of having a having to you know use both abilities. But I don't know if that's true for DPS, and I certainly don't know if it's true at this level. I kill these guys, because otherwise they would just come after me anyway. All right, almost there. Hang in there. Plus, just spinning around, putting fire everywhere looks pretty cool. Heal up a little bit. Yeah, I will enjoy the days when you can set all your companions to whatever mode you want. Healer, tank, DPS. Of course. By the time... You can move while doing this too. By the time that happens, I'll pretty much be done leveling characters, and once you're at max level, you don't use your companions for much of anything. Some people use them for dailies, I guess. Ooh. Yeah, that's an interesting robe. Meant for Sith, obviously. Alright, here we go. Ooh. Heard some whispers there. Creepy. Hey, smelled you coming. Don't you think you're clever? I wonder if the whispers are from like the music they just replaced in the game. Because when a couple patches ago, they did add new music to the game, which I think I mentioned before. I've got the right cool byproducts you asked for. Let me. This will take a minute. Oh, maybe he actually did smell them. I imagine they have quite an odor. Stuff will throw a ragdoll off my trail, but in their den, keep your blaster ready. If these things attack, I'm gonna open up with everything I've got. I'll keep behind you. Smear it thick. If the fumes put the rat ghouls out, we might sneak through. Oh, no, no, no way. I am not getting that whatever all over the... This is my best shirt. Nice knowing you. Wait, wait, wait. D d just do it. Ugh. Now I'm gonna have to burn these. What if the rat ghouls will actually be docile in here? That'd be pretty cool. Doesn't look like it. So, are they going to not aggro when I run through them then? Mind oh, your distance. Oh, you want to keep your distance. Whoops, I see. There is a mechanic to it. I might, there we go. Ooh. Feed a hundred rack wolves. Sweet. See, I know I've done that before because I've been here. Before they had any kind of. It wasn't even double XP back then when I leveled my Sork. It was just the old fashioned leveling. I think my agent too. I don't think there was any double XP then. What's our goal here? That's defeat rack bulls. All right, we want to go over here. So I've definitely killed my fair share of rack bulls on the imperial side, but you wouldn't know it because they didn't have the achievement system in at launch. Oh, he's up. Oh my guy. What are you doing standing there? Let's get to move on. It's been a while. Hear that? No. Nothing? Was it the whispers? I heard them earlier. I don't hear anything. I pitched wine. Oh, this is bad. Trap! I hate always being right. That's true, though. Some ears do hear different pitches in the extremes. And I, being a Twi'lek, maybe our ears aren't as 
good as human ears? Not really sure. Although I'm pretty sure this would happen no matter what species I was, but still. Oh, I see. He's trying to attract the Reckles here. Kill Reckles in the vault. We have to go back and kill all of them, really? Or just these guys? Probably just these guys. Where's my crew going, though? They're leaving me. What are you doing, people? I just got that bonus. You guys are going to die, because I am nowhere close to you. He has a lot of health, though. Hey, we have the bonus mission. that was about. They must have chased them out here or something. Anyway, let's hope the quest doesn't get bugged. Don't want to have to reset it. Aha. Uh -huh. There they come. Burn all the rock wolves. And gold shirt too. That is a lot of debuffs I have on me. That's pretty bad. That's the fair man. Looks like more are going to be coming in a second. Oh, there they are. <laughs> Practice my kiting on the off chance I ever take this character into ranked. It's probably unlikely, though. Blast, 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 blast! Does this look infected to you? So, this art is finally sending children to do his dirty work? Run home now and tell Mandalore if he wants my head, he should come and take it himself. If a bunch of dirty mutants is the best you've got, you're as good as dead. I will tell you what I told the others. You've survived. You have earned the right to the Garoya Beharan. If you lose, however, I will kill you. I'll be waiting at these coordinates. Then we'll see who hunts whom. Real nice guy, your dad. He's toying with us. But the Garoya Baharan gives us an opening. It's a Mandalorian death game. There are four parts. Ali Jate, personal honors. Yeme Sum, the homeworld. The Sterebise, who defends a legacy. And the Nost, who destroys it. He will place honors prize possessions around a battlefield. You will try to take them. If you take all of them, then you must take his home. This is a lot of trouble for a duel. It's a war game, Mandalorian tradition, and it gets us close to him. I'll scout for Jikon's honors while you go to face him, and while you run the game, I'll find his home. Call me when you've made your challenge. All right. Uh... 48 seconds, there we go. Just in time for one more level up. Alright, well, I will travel to these so-called coordinates then. And, uh, I will see you guys when we get there. Alright, we're here at the first marker, I guess this is. Let's see. Uh-oh. I'm at the coordinates. No sign of Jikong. Just some sort of marker. Not good. Wait, I'm wearing armor. Hey, hey, if you want me to steal your ship and run, then just lie still and don't move. <laughs> Worth a shot. You okay? What happened? Challenge accepted. That's how you want to play, Jikong. Transmission cut out. Transmitting coordinates. Should be all of the traitor's honors. Contact you when I found this bolt hole. Torian out. Alright. So, first of all, if he's going to be shooting at me like that, I'm going to put my helmet back on. And, uh... Alright, so I guess we have to go around and collect these things. So this one isn't too far away. What are these things? Scavengers, 
Ferrazid. I'm not sure what a Ferrazid is. They didn't see me, so I like them. Uh, Alright, somewhere around here. Why am I not seeing it? Okay, the marker is just about here. Is it that guy? No. I am right on top of it. What am I missing here? Something painfully obvious? Capture... Which one is this? Uh, capture Jilkin's Oath to Clan Ordo. What is his oath? Like a data recording? Oh, here we go. It's this rock, I guess. Not bad. It's usually over by now. Let's see how far you get. Hey now. Guess it's a good thing I'm wearing this armor after all. Next stop is up here. Hey Terrace, all these I mean, as a design of a planet, it's actually really strangely beautiful in a way. But when you're trying to get around it. A little disorienting. I love the idea, though, of this planet they destroyed the surface of in the first KOTOR game. And now they're going back and sort of showing how it's been 400 years later with all these plants growing over the wreckage. It's a really nice level design. Neighbor's number two. Oh, with the skull. Yeah, what are we okay. shooting today? Finding one that quickly could have been dumb luck. Two, you're getting help. Let's slow you down. All right. Like, can't we just see where he's shooting from and go find him there? That can't be that hard. Uh, I guess we'll get this one next. <laughs> this is a cool idea for a quest, though. I like it. Besides the part where I'm running around just clicking on things, but the idea that like he's hunting you and you have to like lure him out. It might not make a ton of sense, but it is something different that they can do with the mechanics of this game without really pushing themselves. There's a random champion over there. I know I opened the map a lot, I just like to make sure I'm on the right path. I really enjoy how you can keep moving in this game while having your map open. And if some people have like two or three screens and can like leave the map up on the other screen like while they PvP and all, which is actually a pretty awesome idea, but I like to use my other screens to watch TV and yep. stuff. Or in this case, to make sure the recording is still going. It hasn't crashed or something. Ha. You're a real spitfire. If I were young again, I might take you as a bride, girl. Supposed to be a compliment? Found the traitor's bolt hole. Wreckage. Crash ship. The Indar Spire. Oh, that's cool. I can head that direction. No, keep him busy. I'm laying a trap. I'll call when everything's in position. Alright, one more. Better be a good trap. All this running around is worth it. Let's avoid that Veractal. Well, we could actually ride a Veractal if we wanted to. There we go. I like this one better, the irradiated Veractal. I think there's an armored version of it now, but I've already invested enough credits and cartel coins to unlock this on all my tunes, so... Might as well get some use out of this one. Those are the, the classic ones, though, whatever they're called. Marshland Veractal or Swampland Veractal. That one's a diseased Veractal. They also now have the um, infected Veractal from the Rackle event. I have that one on Aerovale, but can't unlock those legacy-wide because they're not a cartel item. All right, here's the last item. What's up? 
Tuck and cover. Torian, that trap ready? No, and the traitor's on his way back. Chickalone's still got one cache left. You think he's on to us? It's just changing strategy. You're winning. He's coming to fortify his stronghold. Transmitting location. I'll do what I can. Hurry. All right. I guess there was supposed to be one more item, but you don't have to do it. Because the idea, the idea was to lure him back, and he's going back. All right, let's follow this little pathway here. I should take us right to his hideout. That's the plan at any rate. It's still weird how like they gave you the option to decline this quest. I looked it up and there's just like no information for SWOTOR quests. There I found on the wiki there's like dead links to all the SWOTOR forums. When they redid those at some point, all those links got broken. And nobody has ever remade any of them since the game came out because nobody really cares anymore I guess. The initial horde of people playing the game already played through it and left. The people that come back don't come in, you know, they trickle in, they don't come in masses, so there's no real yearning to get guides up anymore. But yeah, it's not like uh, where you can look up Mass Effect or Dragon Age guides and see like, oh, if I didn't make that choice, what else could have happened? So I guess I'll never know. It'd be cool if you could just like skip Terrace entirely, but you might lose out on a lot of XP that way. They're, they probably find some way to make you do it anyway, just for a different reason besides the wager. Or maybe you have to contact him again when you're ready to do it. It might be like an optional quest where you uh, you can refuse it, but if you want to do it later, you have to come back. Which makes sense for Bounty Hunter, the main quest would be optional. Because really, aren't they all? I'm not going to bother with these guys. So like I said, bonus quests don't give that much XP. This guy, however, is in my way. What are those things? Mines? Yep, somebody's shooting me. Down you go. Alright. They are... Suspicious scanner. So do we want to avoid them then? I'm going to. Let's pop our hydraulics, so... Alright. Uh-oh. Oh, the servers are going down today? Crap! I didn't realize there was a patch tomorrow. Why is there a patch? And yeah, that's a trap. You guys just patched last week. What the hell? Hopefully it's just like a routine maintenance server restart thing. Oh, that sucks. What am I gonna do now? I was gonna, uh, I was gonna try to stay up all day today and get back my normal sleep schedule. Why can't I rest? There we go. Are my key bindings messed up? Did I never bind it for this one? I could have sworn I was because I was using it earlier. Oh, I must have hit one of the profiles or something. Oh my, that's what it is. There we go. I must have hit one of the profile buttons on my keyboard. All right. <laughs> yeah, they're talking about it now. So much for that plan. Torian, where's Jacob? He got cocky. He's tricky. Electronet put him down, but he used it to cook off his munition cache. And he's running. Don't let the troll go cold. Does Jacob have another hideaway? Didn't see one. Doesn't matter. You can catch him. He's hurt, bleeding, running, deep tracks, well done. bloody mud, straight lines. 
Even you could follow. Um. Job's a job. You're not getting away from me this time. Save my honor. He might die anyway, no matter what you do. Alright, saving up that one. Hope he doesn't die. I kind of like the kid. Ah, uh, the mines are still there. Alright, examine the supply crate. Hopefully it's right outside. Let's go see. I'm just about ready to kill this guy. They have dragged this out long enough. I like how even after your rocket boots wear off, you still run faster until the actual buff expires. It's like the game can't decide whether it wants you to allow you to do it in those zones or not. Alright, he's far away, so I'm going to try to race there before the server goes down, and I will see you in a few minutes. Alright, we're back with a little less than 10 minutes to go. So let's get the show on the road. More mud. Let me know when you find something. Trail still strong. Uh, seriously, they're gonna make me follow this guy. <laughs> this is gonna be annoying. He's not too far, so I'm just gonna keep going at this point. See, it's 10 a.m. That's such a weird time. It's about 7 a.m. PST. I don't. It doesn't make a lot more sense either. They usually do it at the server reset. Like the servers have already reset this. Wait, it's Monday. It's not even the server reset. What are they doing it on Monday for? I'll have to look it up. I'll have to look on the forums quickly because they're going to take the website down too, which is stupid. Because uh, then you can't see what what's going on. Who are we shooting today? Except with my Facebook or something. All right, let's check the food stores. Are we there yet? I feel ya. Apparently switchword.com is already down. Yay! <laughs> so I can't even look to see what the messages are and tell how long it's going to be down for. Good game, Bioware. I'll look up on Facebook in a minute. I'm trying to play your game and you're, you're doing everything you can to stop me. All right. Ah, back to work. This had better be it. You know, we could be robbing a nice, dry, climate-controlled bank right now. <laughs> nope. All right. This had better be the last one. Kind of had a feeling it would be four, though, because that's the point where it's getting tedious, but not so much where the player is really starting to get frustrated. Aha, uh -huh, there we go. That's actually not true. You can toggle off the uh, quest requirement thing. So the bounty hunters move with you, which doesn't count for them, which is also stupid, but we won't get into that. You gave a good run, my friend. Might have done me in if you hadn't left the finale to a novice. You and Arjas have something in common. You're content to let the young do your dying for you. Killing you is gonna feel real good. Looks like we have something in common as well. Let's Beard. dance, girl. Let's do it. Get out. This doesn't seem too difficult. He is five levels lower, so that's probably a big part of it. Uh, uh, just do it. He and I aren't done. Lee Se Gar Su Johar Ir, Har Joha Darmanda, Ibi Turgar, Darbu Ir Balish. Mevain? Ner? Nerad? Oyash? I have a last request, Hunter. I want a moment to speak with my... my son. I think they put the... was it Mandoa in there? I'm not one of those huge Mandalorian fans, but it's cool they put that in there for people who are. They actually did their research here. Um, freeze them. They want him alive? I thought they wanted him dead. Um, yeah, I don't... if you always want to talk for a minute, I don't care. 
Why is that late side and these are neutral? It doesn't make sense. Got an opinion on the matter, Torian? We won't be remembered as traitors. It's over. Thanks for this. Dead is dead. Just a business arrangement. Thanks anyway. It's been an honor. Pleasure working with you too, kid. All right, and that's Terrace. I'm um, gonna head back to the ship, and uh, guess that'll be it for now. Hopefully the servers won't be down too long. Actually, I can look that up. Well, you guys don't care because you can just go to the next episode in the playlist. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I will see you guys then. Thank you.